Like people feel like they have to have so much money and they have to have the nicest things to put themselves together and look good and be worthy when it's really not that like. I just thought about washing my back with this. Oh my gosh, that's gonna feel so good. <laughs> guys welcome back to another vlog if you are new here my name is la 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 okay welcome welcome to my channel and if you are returning then hey girl what's up how you doing so i need to be getting out the door i'm going to meet my friend mo you guys have seen her in my vlog at least three times by now we are going to this place called dania point it's like a Kind of like Fat Tuesdays or Wet Willies, you know? But it's new, never been there, so this will be interesting. Y'all, I hope my TV is not freaking y'all out. I was watching the Ted Bundy documentary. Yes, I'm getting inspired for Vlogtober. Ted Bundy, you know, they describe him as smart and like just, just, this, just this intellectual, handsome guy when I kind of like see right through him like but beyond his education him being educated he's very dumb it's like the things that he like like does like he's not the brightest guy he's kind of just like any other guy but he just has some knowledge because he went to school for psychology he has a psychology degree. But anyway, that's not important. Let <laughs> me get out the door. I hope you guys like the new intro. I was really tired of the purple. Like it was bothering me. Like purple is not one of my favorite colors. It used to be when I was like a tomboy, but then pink became my favorite color. But um, I've really been like warm and neutral lately. So I really wanted like a warm, plain neutral intro i hope you guys like it i have one idea for vlogtober i'm trying to decide if i'm gonna do it during october or do i want to just drop that video on halloween but i don't know if people tune in to youtube are they gonna be too busy on halloween like should i just drop it the day before halloween like halloween eve i might do that so let me know how you guys feel about the intro and if you have any suggestions for me for vlogtober i'm gonna mix these two i haven't done it in a while my ysl libre and my rap reef <laughs> a rap res from louis vuitton they smell so good together because this is like nice and warm with a hint of floral to it and then this is like really really sweet so to put the two together it's really good Okay, so this is what I'm wearing. I look so fluffy, but that's okay. Who cares? This top is from Fashion Nova. My jeans are Fashion Nova. These shoes, some Christian lubes, my little nothing but nude meals. And the infamous Alma BB. Hello, Coco. Hello. He is literally my fucking shadow he's like a stalker i feel so cute like i wanted to be like cute but chill and casual i really didn't even want to wear heels but mo always wears heels because she feels like she's too short well she's not but i just don't want to stop looking at myself i look so cute but okay y'all let's go my girl's already on her way she's probably gonna beat me Fucking no, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Golly. 
fun. <laughs> Is that on Tama? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> says good morning say good morning i have been just thinking about stuff to decorate because i just wanted to look nice in here i'm over it so i just ordered some stuff off of amazon let me show y'all stop staring at me go do something if y'all was here a few vlogs ago when i went to i went to home goods and i saw that round thing I never went back to get it, but I did find one like $10 cheaper on Amazon and it's black with the wood. So I would rather this one, the gold did match my table right here that y'all sitting on, but I want to bring in the black because um, I have to incorporate black because my computer desk over here is black and I actually want to get like a little table to put right there to move my printer on so i can like decorate the top of the desk as well but yeah i want that and then i'm gonna get like two pieces of artwork i don't know what yet but i'm probably gonna look on either amazon or etsy and put like two pictures it's gonna be right here above the couch so the round thing will be in the middle and then i'll have two pieces of artwork on the side sounds cute right yeah and then I also got this round thing because even though, even though I have that one right there, something about it looks a little off. Like it looks cheapy or something compared to this one. I think this one just looks better. And it has like a texture to it with like this grainy look to it. Like it just looks like a cookie or something. <laughs> a cookie. That one is given Dollar Tree. And then that picture, that picture is, I don't know if you guys ever even notice it. It's my two little cousins. They both ended up passing away. I like to keep that picture of them right there. And I love the mind over matter thing, but I'm probably gonna take both of those and put it up on the wall on this thing with, you know, some other aesthetically pleasing stuff. And I also got these. These will probably go in here. So today I'm really just chilling. Um, I gotta go to Target soon. I have to take Coco to go get a bath. So when I take Coco to go get his bath, Target is in the plaza, so I'll just go over there at the same time. And I'm washing clothes right now, so if y'all hear that noise, that's my washing machine and my dryer going. It's my dragon fruit, y'all. I was in the mood for juice this morning. I was so thirsty after last night i had that slushy i had that slushy drink which was really good it's just so cold i really don't like cold drinks that's why i always get martinis i like my drinks chilled but not with ice you know but it was good and then after that i just had three patrons was it no it was called jaja it's a tequila inyejo tequila I had like three of those um, I sipped on. So I was pretty thirsty after I was hydrated. I mean, I was dehydrated, so. But yeah, right now I'm just being a professional belly scratcher. <laughs> Spoiled brat. Uh, 
this on it. And then this one spins. Y'all, I just got a new mop because I really want to mop, but I don't like the mop that I have, so I've just been like swiftering. But I need to like actually mop. I'm gonna do it right now. I got this new mop from Target. It looks like this. And if you guys watch Brooke Kennedy, her uh, page is Brooke Kennedy. You guys should go watch her vlogs. She does really good vlogs. She does like Sunday reset videos, which I actually want to do one. And she does like chit chats and stuff like that too. And a lot of home decor. And she just got a new house. So I'm sure she's going to be doing some more home decor soon. So, but anyway, she had a really cool mop and I found it in Target, but it was like 20 bucks more. Coco is dragging around his leash. I forgot to take it off of him. Come here, Coco. Let me take it off. <laughs> so yeah, this one was a bit cheaper than the one she got, so. But it looks the same, it's the same concept. So I'm about to try it out. next day okay it's the next day i didn't do much after what you guys saw last so this morning i went to dollar tree for scissors and i came out with three bags full of things because it's dollar tree like you just see one thing and you just keep going because everything is a dollar but now everything is 125 like i didn't know they went up like that. It used to just be literally $1. So, I wanna show y'all what I got because I got some cool stuff. So I found these little pumpkin things. I wanted to get them, oh my gosh. Sorry y'all, I live right next to train tracks and a hospital. So there's always gonna be noise. Like you hear the trains going by or you're gonna hear the ambulance going by. So I got these to like put on my shelf to be in the background on my videos, but I didn't realize that they had clips in the back. So, I mean, I could just ignore the clip or pop it off because it looks like it's hot glued on anyway. I needed a pair of scissors. This is where I went in there for, and they had pink, so perfect. The lady that bagged my stuff made no sense. She just, why would you extra wrap plastic but not glass? Anyways, I got these two little pantry things, like vanity organizer, there you go. I'm pretty sure I will use this one for makeup brushes. And then this one, probably lipsticks. Like my lipstick in my drawer, like organize it better. Or probably something in the bathroom, I don't know. But I knew I wanted this one. I just got this one just because I saw it. Got some cotton swabs because they're a dollar and I always need them. I got these two little candles. I actually just ordered some candles that I kind of want to do a video about. Um, they might be here today, so I'll show y'all if they arrive. But I saw these, they're a dollar. Anyway, they're like grapefruit. I can light them in my room or in my bathroom since they're like a smaller size. This surprised me, okay? And this has inspired me to do a whole makeup video 
featuring Dollar Tree, but this surprised me. Look at these lashes. Wait, let me take it out so y'all can see. This is what they look like. They're wispy and fluffy. I like them. I got these cute little thumb taps things for my board over there when I need to like post a note or something. I just thought the aesthetic of it was so cute. I got some tape just because I don't have any. I got this hand soap I'm gonna put in my bathroom. I got some doggy pads because I have a friend coming to visit next weekend, possibly, and she's gonna bring her dog. So just in case, you know, I have these on deck. I used to use ponds all the time, but I stopped for some reason, I don't know. But I saw this and I'm like, let me grab it. It's for discoloration, like a beauty cream or moisturizer type thing going on. Perfect color complex. And last but not least, I got this thing. I gotta clean it, but I just thought about washing my back with this. Oh my gosh, that's gonna feel so good. <laughs> so that's my Dollar Tree haul. I spent $21. I'm tired today. I'm tired. I just wanna lay down for a second. Um, and then I think I'm gonna get up and go to Trader Joe's. I always forget, like I be seeing people I watch on here on YouTube and they go to Trader Joe's and I see all the stuff they get and I'm like, I need to go to Trader Joe's. But I always forget because it's not near me. The closest Trader Joe's to me is like 15 to 20 minutes away. So I never really go, but I wanna go either today or tomorrow, so. I also got this restaurant I wanna go try. I really want to go try it in this vlog. I have two actually on my list. One is this place. I forgot the name of it. I'm going to find it. But they have like mermaids swimming in the wall. And I wanted to go there and see what it's like. And then Eddie V's, my girl Britt. This is her channel. Y'all go subscribe. She does amazing content all the time. I was watching her vlog and they went to Eddie V's and the food looked so good. And my cousin, she loves Eddie V's. And I'm like, I just have never been to this place. So I'm gonna hit up Eddie V's either this vlog or next vlog. It's Vlogtober, so we're gonna do something. You know what I'm saying? And quick reminder if you're watching and you're not subscribed, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. Like this video right now. Right now, I hit 900 subscribers yesterday, so I'm at 901 as of this morning, the last time I checked. So I need 99 more followers to get at 1K, okay? So if you're watching, Coco, you gotta drink water right now. That's, that's selfish. Drink your water, baby, I'm sorry. <laughs> drink your water, little doggy. I got a video I need to do. I don't know if I wanna well, I have two videos. I'm not sure which one I want to do for the weekend, but I need to figure it out because today is already Tuesday. I like to record my videos Wednesday or Thursday, but the last two videos I did, I recorded on Friday. I don't, I don't like doing that because then Saturday morning I have to rush and edit. I don't have to, but I love to have my videos go up Saturday morning, so. So. I know it needs to be a little clean, but do we like this or should I do this? Let's see. Because I love that, but it's just giving young lady. Okay. Really, Coco? Do we like that? I think I like that better. I do. I really do. You did your time. You did your time. <laughs> time for you to go though. Time for you to go. Maybe put my Merit lipstick there. Ooh, that's so cute. Then what about this? Ooh, should I put my foundations in it? Ooh. 
Should I do that? Should I do that? Does that look good? I like this. I like it. Y'all gotta go to Dollar Tree. How cute is that? I mean, that's not amazing, but it's still cute. But I like that. That is so cute. Okay. <laughs> so I just got my Amazon package. Let's see what it is. Okay. bubble candle it smells pretty good <laughs> it's so little i thought it was bigger but yeah i got another little lady candle and then our little tiny thing i wanted it to be small so i'm glad it was the size I figured it'd be. Ah, so cute. Okay, y'all, this is literally like a few hours later. <laughs> I got another package. These are the candles I ordered. Yay! This is my order from Brooklyn, and y'all. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I thought these were gonna be bigger. Oh my gosh. Damn, I thought this was bigger. So basically this is all of the candles that they have like two, they have like two different bundles. And then this bundle is called the downtime. So, oh, it says it right there, the downtime bundle. And then they have another one. I don't remember it off my head, but yeah. Oh my God, they are so tiny. Oh my gosh. This is how tiny they are. I thought they were like full size candles, y'all. <gasps> Don't break it. So they're really tiny, but they smell so good. Oh my God, this smells so good. Good intentions. Happy hour smells like nothing. This one is called Restore. This smells good. I guess I gotta light it, cause that one smells really, really good. This one's called Love Note. They all smell really light except this one. So I'm gonna light and see, you know, what I like. But this one smells so good, I have to light it right now. And aside from that, I got some home room sprays. This one is called Bright, Bright Idea, which I think is from the other collection of candles. And this one is called Happy Hour, which I have a candle and it's the same, so let's see. Mmm. It smells so freaking good. My gosh. It smells so good. It smells like lemonade. Ugh, like a rich lemon, like a rich lady <laughs> drinking a lemon drop martini. Okay. So this one smells like lime. This one smells like lemon. Lemon drop margarita. So good. I love these. Oh, I gotta spray them around. Let me see. Mm. That shit smelled too good. Oh, it smelled good. Y'all ignore my bed. I was laying in here editing. So. See. Yeah, that smelled like a freaking margarita, man. The sprays were worth it. I'm gonna light the candles now and I'll come back and let y'all know if I like it. Good morning, y'all. Next day, it's the next day. I'm just happy to be alive another day and I'm happy you guys woke up today to watch this vlog. Say your thanks, okay? Say your thanks. So y'all, we are on the way to Ross because ah! I gotta get a mount ASAP. Oh my God, why is it always a loud truck? Every time I try to vlog while I'm driving, it's always a loud, monstrous truck next to me. Yeah, go that way. 
It is literally 10 o'clock in the morning. We're going to Ross because I'm doing, I've been wanting to do this video for a while. My ultimate baddie on a budget video. And so for my baddie on a budget video, my message to get across is that you don't have to have, like people feel like they have to have so much money and they have to have the nicest things to put themselves together and look good and be worthy when it's really not that like my clothes the most expensive clothes in my closet are like first of all it's like three items that are actually expensive in my closet as in clothes and i didn't even want those okay my boyfriend got those items thinking you know because they cost more that i would like it more but it's like no yeah okay whatever but if you're gonna spend that, give me some Louis, give me some Dolce and Gabbana. Don't be buying no clothes. Like, so I really wanted to do a little baddie on a budget video to just explain like different types of ways you can dress yourself up. And even when it comes to like hairstyles, shoes, clothing, self care, like it's just so much that you can do. So this might not even be just one video. It might be a few different videos. But I definitely want to do an overview, which would be the video I'm doing today. And then maybe I'll do one that has to do with, you know, like different products for hair, different products for skincare, like a full clothing haul, baddie on a budget, full shoes, you know, stuff like that. But I really wanted to just get that out there to my subscribers because a lot of people tell me like in my comments when they see like my Chanel bag or whatever i've read a comment before that was like oh i never seen a chanel bag or i wouldn't know the difference because i don't have or i never had never saw i'm like people really like i love my chanel bag my louis bags whatever don't get me wrong but like that stuff is really just stuff you know i've seen people dress in outfits and they look like fucking supermodels with purses that have no name, shoes that have no name, like, you know? So I just don't want people to feel like they have to have the best things to look the part. I just feel like I've always tried my best to put myself together to look nice because I just was inspired by other people I would see, like my family members. I have a few cousins like I grew up with. You know, we would see each other on a holiday. They always, every single Thanksgiving and Christmas especially, like I would see these other cousins and it's not, I was never hating. I just used to get so much joy from looking at their clothes. I'm like, yo, they look so good and so cute. I wanna be like that, you know? Especially one of my older cousins. Um, she was like the princess in our minds like me and my closest cousins like she was like the Barbie of the family and I've just always wanted to be like that so with a little bit of stuff I did have whenever my mom she would take me if I could go to the thrift store if I could go to Plato's closet well I did that when I got older but anyways like at any opportunity I could I would always try to put little things together and just look as good as I could and a lot of people would think you know otherwise about me like I probably you know had money and stuff but it really wasn't that it's just I knew how to dress <laughs> or at least to my liking I felt like I knew how to dress and obviously I did because people would compliment me and always ask me where I get stuff from and I think that's what kind of pushed me to um into this YouTube world is that people always ask me where did you get your hair from? Who did your hair? Where's that outfit from? Where are those shoes from? Like people always ask me. So I'll post things on Instagram like, oh, just letting y'all know what I got this week. I just wanted to show you guys this new makeup product I got. And I think that kind of pushed me to YouTube. But yeah, so I really want to do this baddie on a budget. We're pulling up to Ross right now. So hopefully we find something. I mean, we will. Ross is one of the main places I used to go. Ross and Burlington. Getting. I found my girl. And twenty-two. 
too. Look at this. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And that. I don't know if my pumpers will fit in here. And those two. Hmm. All these cute little things. Like that. Y'all, I went in there with the expectation of buying one or two things. <sighs> this is what we got today, okay? I'll just show y'all really, really quick. I feel like this whole vlog has been me just showing y'all shit that I bought. <laughs> but I've been saving a lot of money because I haven't gone out to eat. Um, except um, in this vlog, but that was, um, the food wasn't expensive. So I got these two perfumes, but I already have Pink Friday. I've been wanting to get like every single one just to like have all of her fragrances because you know I'm a barb. Yeah, let's smell them. I know I smelled this recently and I was like, oh my God, I gotta get it. And then I found it in Ross for $22.99 instead of $30 at Ulta, so. Okay, this one is definitely stronger than Pink Friday. Oh, this smells so good. Wow. People be sleep on my girl. So here's the Ariana thank you next. So cute. This little tiny ting. That smells good. Like her other fragrance kind of reminds me of this. I think they kind of like put the same notes in some of their stuff. Like this smells oriental, but like a wood. Yeah, it's sweet. I don't know, but I got some good perfume today. <laughs> Batty on a budget, okay. This top, like I know, probably looks really hoochie or whatever. But watch when I put it together as an outfit, like, ooh. I found these little leather shorts and they have pockets. This is a look, okay? I can't wait to wear this shit. Oh, by the way, this top was $9.99. These shorts were $7.49. Y'all better go to Ross. Stop playing. Go to Ross. Make sure y'all watch the video so y'all can see me try these on. I'm just showing y'all real quick in the vlog because I've been showing y'all stuff this whole vlog. Just stuff that I've been buying. So this long sleeve ruche, ranch, whatever dress has some ties at the end. Super cute. This is what made me turn around and buy more stuff because I saw these pants and I was like, I got to get them. This is how they look. They have like a thick band right here and some pockets. The material feels so good. It's very stretchy. And they're like a ankle. They go to your ankles, I think. But they like skinnies. But I just love, I love these. Oh my gosh. Now the rest of the stuff is just, <laughs> now the rest, I just got a few blouses because just like this one I have on. Um, I like to have stuff like this on. If I'm just running errands or going like to the mall real quick or just something quick, I like to have on like a oversized kind of shirt with maybe some leggings or some jeans, but I love when the shirts aren't always tight. Like I love my fitted shirts, but sometimes I want to just be comfortable and just go. I think this one might be in the video too, cause it's really cute. So like a long sleeve blouse with these little details on the shoulder. And I got this little spaghetti strap type blouse. With these cute little details on the side. And last but not least, I got this olive button up which was $13.99 the most expensive clothing item I got <laughs> it's just a, a olive like regular button up top and then you can like put the button up on the side 
Speaking of barbs, because I was talking about, you know, my girl, Nikki. Hey, girl. But anyway, I wanted to shout out my two favorite barb people. Well, two of my favorite barb people. <laughs> August and Rello, they show me so much love on their shows that they do here on YouTube. And I actually got a few subscribers from them, you know, shouting me out. And they just do like stories on the rap girls and what's going on in the media, like all the drama that these female rappers are dealing with, but they are absolute Nicki Minaj defenders because this industry just always tries to just bring her down and the barbs cannot be stopped, okay? So I really appreciate their channel because they're one of the many channels that, you know, defends Nicki Minaj. If you're into that, please subscribe to August Umbrella, but warning, they do not come to play especially with the live shows. So shout out to August and Rillo. Thank you for always being so supportive and kind to me. And yeah. And shout out to the new subscribers I got this week from the show. Um, today is Wednesday. So the show was yesterday on Tuesday. I got like eight, eight subscribers when he shouted me out. All right, y'all. See you later. What's up, y'all? I am on my way to go pick up I don't know why I brought Coco. I'm going to pick up my Luby girls from the shoe guy, finally. Um, he had to fix the bottom of my shoe and my heel, um, but he has been out of town, so. Y'all, all my energy is gone. My period came on. So, the video I was supposed to do today, I'm gonna, like, when I get back home, I'm gonna take some leave, see if I feel better. But I just feel, y'all know how it is. Y'all saw me in New York. <laughs> wow, it's been a month already. Wow. But y'all saw how I was in New York. That's how I feel right now, so. Just not as bad as New York, so. I know this has been a chatty, chatty vlog, y'all. All of my vlogs are chatty, I realized. Like, I was complaining in the beginning, like, I feel like a lot of YouTubers talk way too much in their vlogs but now I see like you have to talk like how else can you communicate with your people it just seems like a lot because it's only me talking so it seems like I'm just going and going because I'm not having a conversation with someone else I don't think I do that bad like the the argument still stands though some people literally only talk and do nothing else i try to at least show what i'm doing in my vlog y'all my shoes they're so pretty so he replaced my the red bottom if you guys can see right there there's a little line so they put this red piece so it doesn't scratch up at the bottom anymore and then he went ahead and fixed my heel too because my heel was really bad the iron was coming out at the bottom but those shoes were messed up. If you guys saw my red bottom video, um, I was showing, I was basically just giving my advice and tips on purchasing and taking care of these shoes. And I did an unboxing in the video as well. If y'all seen that video, y'all saw these shoes before I fixed them. And then they got worse from the point at the time of the video. So I'm glad they are fixed. But yeah, y'all, I, I don't know how much I'm going to be vlogging today. I don't even know if I'm going to do my sit-down video. I'm probably going to do it next weekend and just let this vlog be the only video that goes up this week because I just don't feel good right now. I hate my menstrual cycle. I hate it. Hey, y'all, so one more thing I want to talk about today before I go lay down in my bed, which I'm sure I'm going to do for the rest of today because I feel like absolute shit. I wanted to talk about Fiverr, or Fiverr, however you say it. This app right here. You can order like people to do, you know, whatever you need for your YouTube channel. I just ordered a new button, um, my new subscriber button, because the other one I have was cute, but I wanted it to say Lala, because I'm always like, hi, my name is Lala. That's not my name on YouTube. So let me show y'all what I got. It was $10. He sent me 
two different buttons with four different options. Um, one with green screen, one without green screen for each, but still uh, two buttons. So let me show you. Did it focus? Yeah, I see how now it says code name Lala. So people can see, you know, that's my nickname. Yeah, this is given vlog, like in the beginning. So I may use this for vlogs in the beginning and then this for at the ends and middle of my vlogs and also every other video, like my sit down videos. So yeah, y'all don't sleep on Fiverr. If you need help, just go on there and get something. I got a bitch, she gon' kill for real. Talking about Clyde and Bunny. Cool with the kid, copy. Got to pull up with a stick, stop it. Stop it. Rich nigga shit. Y'all, so I got this white dress twice, and I'm like, why did they send me two of these dresses? Like, did I make a mistake? Like, what happened? I freaking ordered it twice. Oh my gosh. Oh, postmark. Duh. Post it up. I kinda hunted a better one hundred. Back in two hundred a better two hundred. I might go put all my chains on. I just might change up the weather. No, I'm heading out for date night. I just finished filming. Uh fuck me. I got deodorant all over my clothes. This top is so hard to put on. This dress I'm in. Okay, well this is naked wardrobe. I got on my red size, but I'm really wearing my Luby girls. So this vlog well last few minutes because I'm getting ready to close it right now but I wanted to show you guys my little desk came I just put it together this morning um, I put the printer in the middle so I could decorate the top all this well you guys saw this already I switched it over here I'm about to show y'all what I bought to put right here but I ended up putting it on my coffee table I got that little pumpkin from Target. The book is from Amazon. That thing is from Amazon. The little candle is from Amazon. And that black thing is from Home Goods. And this is my desk. I tried to put this up on the wall, but it will not stick for nothing. Um, I'll probably figure out with my boyfriend how to get that up there. And then all my regular stuff that's been here, I got this book thing. This is from Target. It's really cute. I'm trying to show y'all the divider. So it's clear with a gold divider. It's really, really cute. If anyone's wondering what this is, sometimes my neck starts to hurt when I'm looking down at my tablet because I edit my videos on here. So sometimes I'll put my tablet on here and connect my mouse. So I edit with it looking up as if I'm looking on my computer. Smart, right? I found this at... <laughs> smart i found this at burlington y'all the living room is coming together now y'all see why i do the black because that desk and chair is black that was like the first thing i've ever had here so the desk and the couch were my first two pieces of furniture and obviously my bed so i have to bring that in it looks really really cute 
I usually have a pink blanket, but I switched it to this one so it could match everything else. Hey, Coco. Then over here, y'all, everything is coming together. I still want to switch that, the vase that's holding the pompas. We're going to do that later. I'm tired. <laughs> I think I'm gonna vlog again this next week for Vlogmas, I mean Vlogtober. That round thing I ordered, it's supposed to come today, so you guys will get to see it in the next vlog, or if it comes before I upload this, I'll add the clip. So this thing, y'all, is what I ordered to put over there, but I ended up not liking it over there. I like it better right here. I want to change those pompas. I, I know these little leaf thingies I want to get from Home Goods, and also in there too. I'm gonna to switch them, but I have to go get that. You guys will see that next vlog as well. And then I put those little pumpkin things from the dollar store right there too. You know, give fall time. It's giving fall, and I just did my pretty little thing haul. Y'all go check it out. That's what I was putting up here yesterday. Um, since these clothes came in yesterday, I thought they would come in next week, but they came early. I forgot I paid for the faster shipping. So I did that haul instead of the baddie on a budget video. So go check it out. So y'all, I was just closing the vlog and then this came to my door. Tell me why they're so small. I need to read. Okay. I need to read. That's what happened with the candles. I didn't read the size. This is so small. <laughs> what the hell? No, ma'am. What? No, ma'am. I paid $45 for this? I could add it in my room as a perfume shelf. I don't know, y'all. I feel so stupid. Y'all, I had just put some stuff on it just to see. Let me know what y'all think since I'm working on this. If y'all think like, no girl, that is ridiculous. Take it down. <laughs> Cause it's so small. But remember, I am going to have two pictures. I'm going to put two pictures, one here, one there. Like, should I bring it down more to be next to two pictures? Or should I just get rid of it? And start over again try to go get a bigger one here's a low view y'all let me know i think i can make it work if i go get the two pictures so let me know what y'all think so y'all thank you i'm using a mirror to close the vlog thank y'all so much for tuning in please don't hesitate to give this video a thumbs up leave me a comment down below uh subscribe because why aren't you subscribed i think i'm at 119 119 i'm at 919 subscribers so subtract 100 from 19 that's how much i need to be monetized so let's get it <laughs> thank y'all so much for watching and i can't wait to see y'all in the next video